Hi, I'm Dr. Newton. This is a minute of medicine for your mind. Have you ever heard of Go Corporation? Well, they were the forerunners of pen or touchscreen technology, and they made it possible for the Palm Pilot and the iPad to exist. Well, how about Kerbango? Kerbango was the forerunner in internet radio. They made it possible for Pandora and iHeartRadio to exist. Or maybe you heard of LoudCloud. They focused on cloud-based computerized applications, and they made it possible for OneDrive, Google Drive, and iCloud to exist. Or how about Let's Buy It? Dot com. They focused on uh, 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 retail sales, and they made it possible for one of my favorites to exist, Groupon. Now, all of those startups were super ideas. How do we know? Because the companies that exist today are making hundreds of millions, if not billions of dollars a year. But all of those startups failed. You know why? Because they all relied upon one thing, technology. And technology at that time hadn't matured to the level where it could make the three A's possible for those companies to, to excel with their consumers. Accessibility, affordability, and applicability. You see, what I'm trying to say to you today is real simple, see. No matter how great your idea or how noble the cause may be for the organization of the people that you lead or for the personal goals that you're trying to accomplish within yourself, you must deliberately make yourself aware of and synergize with all the factors around you that have the ability to affect you accomplishing your outcomes. You see, you must respect kingdom leadership principle number six and accept that timing is crucial. The law of timing flips us from being an independent variable where we create our own path and we steer the wheel of life that will either get us to our destiny or not into a dependent variable where there are many factors around us and those factors create the conditions and events upon which our desired outcomes are dependent. So we have to keep our eyes wide open and our head on the swivel. Just like if you were playing double dutch and you're about to jump in a rope that's already turning or you were coming down an on-ramp about to merge into speeding traffic on a busy highway. If you don't time things correctly, you have a problem on your hands. My point is this, man. I know you're excited to launch your work and share with the world the great things you've been working on. But no matter how great that idea is or no matter how noble the call is, you still have to look before you leap. You have to flip into dependent variable mode and consider all of the variables that could possibly affect your outcomes. Your level of respect for kingdom leadership principle number six is either going to make or break your ability to share with the world the great thing that you're accomplishing. However you look at it, timing is crucial. I'm Dr. Newt, and this was a minute of medicine for your mind.